How you guys doing? We're going to go ahead and start with our second video, and that's dealing with uh, fourth, fifth, and middle school um, tutorial upstairs. So let me go ahead and take you guys upstairs so we can get a better glimpse of how we actually move when it comes to going upstairs and stuff. But again, as you notice, we have our one-way direction to make sure our students know what side and everything they should be on. So as we actually come up here, we always start off, um, we have our fifth grade class first. We have one fifth grade class in this hallway here, and we also have our AVID program. So we have a fifth grade class and also our AVID uh, computer lab, where that's where our AVID classrooms and things will be at. And again, like I said, when we come upstairs, we always go in a one-way direction. So again, we have our restrooms, have all our hand sanitizers, but we wanna make sure we stay in a one-way direction. So now that we also in our one half of the fifth grade hallway, these two classrooms here are the, the other two fifth grade classrooms. So again, that's just a, you know, trying to keep everything centralized as we keep moving forward. We also have our, um, our art classroom here. So we have other classrooms here in this area too. So again, that's our middle school art room. Now, as we come around this corner, and again, you notice like on the floor, we have our, we're still practicing our social distancing and making sure everybody understands that we're a one-way building upstairs. And then the same thing we have on the walls and things like that to kind of make sure we know. So now we're entering our fourth grade um, hallway. So these are four fourth grade hallway, I mean, uh, classrooms. So just to kind of give you a heads up on uh, some of our, um, our, where our fourth grade classroom. So when you come around the corner, these are our fourth grade um, rooms um, down at the end. All right, so now that we actually in the uh, middle school hallway, how we have it set up here is that the first three classrooms on the, on the right hand, left, well, if you're going around the hallway, it'd be the left hand side. The first three are sixth grade classrooms. The next three are seventh grade classrooms. And the three that's on this side is actually our eighth grade classroom. So again, this would be our middle school hallway here. So mainly the only ones you see in this hallway is our middle school students. So now we're working our way back to the uh, stair area. And again, like you said, we try to still keep our social distance. And again, we have our restrooms and our hand sanitizers and everything that we need to make sure that we're staying um, covert uh, ready. And um, you know, again, try to stop the spread of the disease. So, and again, when we do our middle school stuff, just so we understand, it's like the kids will actually, the students will actually stay in their classrooms. Our teacher will actually rotate, so that'll make sure that you know it, it alleviates them coming into the hallway, being so close um, together and everything like that. And then only time they actually leave those classrooms is when they actually go into AVID, art, and also PE. So those are the main three times, and then also lunch would be the times that they actually had that type of movement uh, while they're up here um, or at school. Thank you. 